Hey Daddyo! Hey Riverdale fans, what is up? Welcome back to our channel where we are going to be watching episode 5 from season 2 of Riverdale and I am already freaking out. Are we almost halfway? No, there are 22 episodes in season 2. I mean... <laughs> The reason I'm freaking out is because I watched the trailer for episode 5, Hanka doesn't I watch trailers, but I did and I am already freaking shooketh. out, I'm shooketh, so let's get right into this episode and... Okay. okay. Were you there? At the town hall? Oh yes. But you didn't hurt anyone. Tonight was all about you. What do you want? The same as you. To set Riverdale on the righteous path again. Is that he was watching us. I don't know, he could be. No. I know. It sounds crazy, but it was him. Hey, you have to tell the police, even if it's not him. It is him. And he told me if I went to the police or if I told Jughead, he... God, he knows what Polly is. If he told the police or Jughead, he would know. I'm letting you go through this a lot. It's payback time. What are you guys talking about? Ooh. They were the ones that went there. Okay, but Archie was the one that did the spray paint. A what bomb? He's gonna build us something. We'll do it after hours. But it'll shut the Riverdale register down once and for all. You think blowing up a building is going to make things better? It can't get any worse. Yeah, sweet pea. It can. Let me talk to Archie. Let me figure this out, okay? Man, that's your answer for everything. Talk and more talk. This is like. Are these high school kids? But I do kind of... It is what they do in high school, like, you do rash things. Your side has been dumping on us for years. Your dad tried to keep the peace. Avoid bloodshed. Now that he's gone and he gets like sweet pea, I think there's only one path and one solution. Violence. So now he's gonna keep the peace. Let me just say something about Jughead's dad. It's good to hear that he was like the peacekeeper between the north side and the south side. Yes. It was, it's good to hear that about FP because, you know, it's hard to root for someone that kind of did do things wrong. But, I mean, he did his best with what he was given and the situation yeah. he was in. What he had to do was keep the peace in that way and he got caught out. Yeah. yeah. But now it's Jughead's turn. And he, but it's is new, so he's, he's got to like figure this shit out. Oh, Archie Ken, this can't be jolly. It's just a ghost from my bad girl past, Nick St. Clair. Breezing to town for the open house, he's nothing to worry about. Is he gonna be jelly? I love Veronica, and that was cringy AF. Archie Ken's don't be jelly. Like, either say, oh, Archie, don't be jelly, or say, yeah, yeah, Archie can yeah. don't be jealous. Don't overdo it. Like, don't overdo it, girl. <laughs> Loyal. See, this guy's crazy because he thinks I want something in return. They are working together, yes, they both want yes, the town. Yes, yes. You do this for me, and then you get to ask me a question, and I have to answer. Oh, again. Okay. Again, I'm already thinking what should she ask him? He has information about Alice when they were younger. So this he's been there a long time. This is making me think like, is it how? Yeah, I'm because leaning towards how because he's silent and like not he hasn't said anything yeah, yet. Yeah, he hasn't said much in the season and because he knows Alice well and they had like issues with her being a bad girl because yes, she was yes, pregnant yes. and okay, let's What keep. about what about the mayor's husband? What is he doing? Oh here's the initiation going to start. Let's do it. 
<laughs> We're publishing that mugshot. We all know how to have venom glands removed. Okay, the important thing is you show no fear, you grab the knife, and you remember all the laws, which means you're almost a serpent now, Jackie. Almost. Or was it that what you called him? Jaggy, Jaggy. Oh, no man, when she's alone. So that everyone thinks that. Obviously she's not. Like we're, we're friends. We're old friends. Nick, Nick, I need it. Stop! So unless you want that to go away, I'd be thinking of ways you might start showing me some appreciation. If you need any help, I can suggest a couple. Yes! But now, like, Jughead needs to cut her out and she needs to cut Jughead out. So at the end of the day, yeah, yeah. they're gonna have to because of circumstances. And they're both gonna do it for ulterior motives. Yeah, so that's sad. What? What? Uh, mom? Mom? Hello, mom. <laughs> but it came to say Alice Cooper. Damn. I'm choosing to blame Betty's Britney Spears mountain. I'll let you make it up to me. Okay, I'm going to have to go Oh yeah. Oh, they have to always mix two amazing yeah. moments. Go through the tunnel. Do it, man. Oh, oh. She's gonna see. Save her. Get there. Another question, though. I don't know. Yes, because she left Jackie. Yes. Ask me a question. There's only one I care about now. You want to know who I am? 
Don't do this. Yo! Why did I do this? A gun or something? What is it? It's the hood. Oh no, it's no, just the hood. no. Put it. She is the black hood? making this series well fucking done thank you for just you know giving us life it's so good so effing good i can't i'm not gonna bubble on too long about it like i did last time but just there are no words to describe just a few my emotions. things just a few things yes the caller said when you tell the cops i'll know but he knows everything, like he even knew when she told Archie. He said well, if, you'll tell the, if you tell the cops, I'll know. If you tell Jughead, I'll know. If you tell anyone, he will know because he's watching her all the time. Which and makes then, and then mm -hmm. on the phone, he said, oh Betty, who says that? Cheryl. Just, I want to read that Honestly, again. there are too many, because I've been, I'm on this app called Amino, and it's like a fandom app, and there's a Riverdale Amino, and someone has been chatting to me about who it could be um, and to every one thing you there say is. there's a counter yes. thing so far for me sheriff or hell maybe it's them both i don't fucking know imagine jason was alive and it was <laughs> jason like honestly there is i have no theories and it's sad because for every person that gives a theory i'm like no but, but. that's yeah. But that's what the show does. In in an episode, you think, oh, that's a theory, and then, but oh, this. But. Okay, can we just talk about how fucking amazing the Pussycats and Veronica were? Like, <laughs> thank <laughs> God, thank you for that amazing. Yo. Like, thank God. Heroism. And, and it was like, she punched him, and then they were kicking yeah. him. And I like that that they made him like a really bad character and I was gonna die because I never really wanted him anyway so like it makes me so proud that Veronica like didn't allow him to manipulate her into like yes. doing something and then they kicked his ass because he deserved that obviously I also like how, how they used the episode to like stall this guy, stall this guy. You think, oh, he's gonna do something, he's gonna do something. Yeah, I didn't expect that though. I did not expect like sexual assault. No. Like, she said he was a flirt and he was flirting the whole time. Yeah, but. Archie was like eyeing him and something was gonna happen, but it yeah, was but so Yeah, but that was like when... serious. That I wasn't know. something to take lightly, but I like how this um, series this and the season talks about like expresses and showcases social issues like What's this really north possible? side and the south really side possible. and like surreal things teens yeah. are going through except you know for serial killers and stuff that doesn't happen to every teen but, but bullies do bullies do yeah and emotional manipulation all yes. that kind of stuff this is really like honestly this is a really good series 
I still have a lot to say though. But I, I know, I know. I can't you wrap my head around everything. it. I can't wrap my head around it. Um, favorite character from this? Betty. Betty, because she's a good actress. Yeah. Like, and a good character. And she's like thinking what she does of, for her friends. And yeah, like, she's thinking of like, what can I do for this guy? To keep her free and her brave. family. Yeah, she's yeah. brave. Don't if this ever happens to you, don't do that. Just I don't know what you can do. I don't know what I would have done in the same situation. I actually loved all the characters except Veronica's one really cringy. <laughs> Why? Quick to point that out as well. No. The Pussycats were amazing, Veronica was amazing, Archie was a good guy in this, you have to admit. A jughead is trying to, you know, do what he can with his circumstances and but now it's gonna be hard. Because he did this to be able to protect, like to keep the peace, but now he's got his own grudge against. Oh, and excuse me, Tony. Like, she was just waiting for her chance. And also, I thought she was gonna be a bisexual character. I, I was hoping she would, you know, first maybe hook up with Cheryl before hooking up with a guy. <laughs> <laughs> but you know thank you guys for being here thanks for watching let us know your favorite character and any theories you might have about the black hood but i'll probably comment but what about <laughs> yeah so we'll see you guys in the next video <sighs> thank you so much for being here with us okay bye